Hi, Peter Swanson here to talk about um, my newest thriller, Every Vow You Break, and the inspiration behind this book. So um, this book's a little different in the sense that I was inspired more by the type of story I wanted to tell as opposed to the specific plot I wanted to tell. So in my previous books, um, I tend to write what I think of are as um, fairly complex psychological thrillers. They often have two or three narrative voices that tell the story from different perspectives. They often have um, different time periods. So there's a time period that's being described in the past that affects the present. Um, and what I wanted was a break from that. And I wanted a to write what I think of as a linear thriller, a book in which um, a single event um, starts a, a ball rolling or a snowball rolling down a hill and it gets, gets larger as it goes. Um, I think of um, the types of books that Ira Levin used to write, like Rosemary's Baby and Stepford Wives, or these sort of premises where we follow the perspective of um, a single character as she wonders what's going on around her. So in my book, um, Every Value Break, uh, the main character is Abigail Baskin. She is a slightly hesitant uh, bride-to-be on her bachelorette weekend in the opening scene where she has a um, drunken one-night fling with a stranger whose name she doesn't even get. Um, she hopes to put this mistake behind her, but um, when she goes on her honeymoon to a remote island off the coast of Maine, uh, the stranger is there stalking her. Um, and from there, um, the this, this story uh, changes um, rather rapidly um, in a way that I hope surprises the readers in the same way that Abigail herself is surprised by the events that are transpiring. Um, it's a little bit inspired by fatal attraction, certainly the idea of someone trying to cover up their infidelity. Um, and it's also a little bit inspired by um, The Wicker Man, one of my favorite uh, thrillers set on an island. Um, I hope you enjoy it. I hope you're doing well. And I hope you're getting lots of great reading done. Thank you.